being a breast cancer survivor, I have to admit, changed my life. It changed the course of my life and where I wanted to go because the fear of what could happen and the possibility of me not raising my children was one of the most difficult times of my life. I remember having a conversation in the, in the salon with clients and laughing about it and saying, I'm only 40, what are they talking about, mammogram? And I had a doctor, Dr. Berkman, who is my OBG, who called me three times and yelled at me and said, I still don't have your results. What's the worst thing that could happen? Something is wrong or something is not, and you're fine. So I listened and I went, and they called me back for um, an ultrasound. And they called me back again for an MRI. The MRI pinpointed three nodules in both breasts. In 2010, I found out that I had cancer myself. It was shocking. I would have never imagined that after almost 30 years of nursing, I'd apply some of the things that I teach to uh, my patients, to myself. But I do come from a family of cancer survivors, and it's been a positive experience, if I might say, because we've utilized the experience to teach others. It was an experience that I'm very thankful for, that I was in this country and diagnosed at an early age, that I beat it. It's about your life. When you hear that cancer word and other diseases out there that is killing us, you need to really know what you're going for, and that's what I did. It's taken me to another level on how to live life. So I feel very fortunate because of the work that I do. I take very few things for granted. I'm able to understand on a personal level what some of my patients are going through. That's a great thing. I felt breast cancer gave me extra wings. Breast cancer gave me extra strength. Breast cancer gave, gave me extra push to really there's no limits now. I made it. You're kidding me? I'm going to live it up and do all that I can do. I think that being strong and being knowing who you are is what helped me.